All right, so things just keep getting worse and worse and worse and worse. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. My name is Jack the Buster, I Shinobi. We have episode 129 of our My Hero Academia watch today called the Hellish Todoroki Family Part 2. Oh no. And the last one, we saw the absolute insane prison break of both Tartarus and uh, many other prisons around the world, seeing a lot of familiar faces in terms of villains being broken out. And yeah, dude, it's just getting rough for the heroes out here. If you're new to the channel, drop us up and hit that big boy bell and let's hop into it. Oh, this is uh, a little bit of Hawk's backstory because I am here. He always fi fixed the problem. So are, are Hawk's wings permanently burned off? Are they gone forever? I don't got that anymore. I and mean, they have Endeavor, but... What is that elephant? Did that elephant deserve jet burn? What was just an elephant with a sledge? Oh, he's a big elephant. Never mind. It was so easy. Then once he got into the thick of it, he realized they were just like him. Mm. His dad's got like feathers too. He just wanted to fly around a bit. Oh my gosh. Oh, he just lived on, on the lamb. Tomie? Tomie? Tomie. Oh my gosh. Right in front of him. This little endeavor doll. Is that why this is the hellish Todoroki family? It's sort of like Todoroki's, but way worse. Just in a different way. Oh no, it's her eyes too. Wait. Oh, a hero took his dad. Oh, they're not this fictitious thing. Mm. Oh my gosh. He didn't want to use them for bad, I guess. Oh, he got recruited. Oh my gosh, they saw how much potential he had. Oh man, That's, that was easy for her, I imagine, too. She didn't seem to care at all about him. I think that we saw a little glimpse of this before. Whenever uh, Dobby named him. Gosh. You see how much uh, like heroes like Endeavor especially impact just random kids around the world. Or I guess in Japan specifically. Mm. Oh, he's awake. Brother! So, his wings? Oh, they're in the Batmobile! Oh, he's got like a... He's like talking through that. Oh my gosh. Dude, yeah, it is kind of ironic they're in the car together. Stress denim. I do like the voice, it's cool. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. That's why he's been just MIA ever since. God dang, dude. Okay, that makes a lot more sense. Afraid spot. Oh, just villains running rampant. Glutton God. I imagine this is just really casual right now with how many broke out. Oh, brother. I love how everything about Best Genus has to do with, like, jeans. Denim. Oh my, that was so efficient! Glutton God, you did not last long at all, brother. Due to my condition. I love you, Best Genus! Nobody's coming anymore, bro. Yeah. The heroes? Oh my gosh. They just straight up dipped. You can see the dismay some have now. It's not all bright faces for the heroes anymore. It's such a cool theme, though, to explore. That never has been explored in My Hero. 
It's just really depressing. <laughs> okay, where is this? Oh, they found her. His mom. Oh, wow. That's how, he, that's how Dobby found out? All the lines are connecting. That's how he knew. He, he, he saw himself as it's a, it's a better thing. It was like good for the both of them. Especially because she didn't want to be a part of his life, sadly. Nothing tying him down in terms of the safety commission? What does that mean? This is like a haunting track. It's like struggling to speak. It's so cursed. It's like he's lost his path. What? Confront him about that? Oh my gosh, dude. The sound design, the audio design in this show is something else. The way it like came in, it was like surround sound basically after being all staticky and scattered areas. It was crazy. There's just gonna be people busting in places all, all around. She in prison escapee. And now heroes are just like in, in different, more undercover type positions, I guess. One way or another. Oh my gosh, Wash. It has been a minute. The seeds have been sown. It's just a level of crime you can't stop. They're not going to be able to stop. Oh my gosh. It's a different world now. It's just people killing each other. Before Wash could like... Just reprimand and, and capture villains. And then they just blame Wash. That is so sad. You gotta do what you have to do, or what you can do. God, you, you can't win, you can't lose. The number nine hero turning in his blade. You feel like they blame you if you if you're a hero and blame you if you aren't. Oh my gosh, it's gonna be just chaos. There's no one tying them all together anymore. All Might was, Endeavor was, now there's just no one. I mean, it's not like Endeavor is dead or retired or it's just there's no symbol. Oh my gosh, Stain. And he got his blade. Oh gosh. Oof. It's a new age. Yep. They were all, it was all an endeavor. Everything with his public reputation, though, is, is shifted. Stuff like that, you can't just do one thing in particular to fix either. They see you that way now. Like I said, as bad of a person as it never was and what he's done, I don't think the entire thing with Dobby he did know about. He really thought Dobby had died. At least based off of his reaction. Toya. I guess I should call him Toya now, not Dobby. Shoto was the responsible one. He froze. He's apt for his power, too. Oh, so Genius went out and tried to try to fix everything. Not everything, but give his word. The damage is done. Once again. Oh my gosh. He sees him crying. Oh man. They've probably never seen him in a, such a vulnerable moment before. They've probably never seen him cry. Ever. Oh, dude. <gasps> it is her. Oh my gosh. <gasps> Oh my gosh. It had to be her. It couldn't be anybody else. And Toya. Maybe she knows more. Why do I watch week to week?
Wait! It's fine. It's fine, man. What a, what an episode. Oh, gosh. All right. Well, big, big kind of, uh, not cliffhanger, I guess, loose in with Hawks. I guess he's headed towards Endeavor. He's he's going to plan something around surrounding Endeavor. Probably just find out more about it. I mean, he said more about his origin, but what could he want out of it is the question. Maybe he does want to answer more of the question about what is a hero that Twice kind of cemented because Twice thought he was fighting for the right thing. He thought he was the hero. He thought they, the, his whole side was they were the heroes. But dude, Endeavor's development is just probably one of the best, if not the best in the show. Like I know a lot of characters have gone through a lot, but seeing someone in, in pictured, especially in the very beginning as sort of an antagonist, someone that I thought would be a villain eventually, just brought to this point where he's in shambles in front of his family. The last character you would think to ever even cry in front of someone is just a, a teary mess because of everything that's happened surrounding him. I think my favorite part of the show is the entire, I guess, just arc in terms of the, the Todoroki family, including Shoto's character. It's just, it's impeccable. It's why I always feel weird about MHA is because I don't really care about Deku even remotely as much as I do a lot of other characters, which is very odd for for the mc to feel that way but i don't know am i alone in that let me know in the comments it's just the way i've always sort of felt about mha but that's it for me for episode 129 if you're new to the channel drop us up and hit that big wood bell and i'll catch you in the next one peace peace